Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to a short C-sharp tutorial. And today we're going to make boss man move up and down and or left and right and even in and out along the Z-axis if you want to do that. So first thing as usual, right click to create a C-sharp script called Floaty. And open up Floaty. Floaty make float face. We're going to use the start and update functions on the script, so don't worry about deleting them. And we need to write a few variables, and one is going to be vector3, and it's going to be called move direction, vector3, x, y, z, and that's going to return 0. If you want, you can put equals 2.5f or something like that, but um, right now, just leave it. And another, oh, sorry, uh, float. Float was just a decimal. And it's going to be called move distance. And you're pretty smart, so you can, it's pretty self explanatory. But float, and it's going to be called move speed. And then we need to, um, this is going to be another vector three, but we'll make it private. If you want to see where the vector, the vector three is in the specter, then make it public. But um, we'll just make it private this time. And vector three, and it's going to be start position. So get used to writing this. I like to copy and paste. Start position is going to be equal to oops, game object dot transform dot position. So wherever this whatever script game object the script is placed on when we start the game um, is where this is going to be. So pretty cool. And then an update is where we're going to do all the magic. Transform position. No, not the parents. Equals start position. plus move direction times we're going to make move distance times math f so math f is just um, says right there math function functions almost slipped up pretty bad on that one this is a g ready show guys math f In. and um, that's going to take a couple arguments time dot time times move speed and if there's any problems unity will definitely let me know boss man don't forget to add the script to it not game manager boss man now this is kind of cool so you know the same about these all return zeros right here uh, just like this real quick. Uh, the all region zeros, if you want to see uh, move direction would be equal to 1.5F, it would be, um, it would show up right there. So, if you hit play, since they're all zeros, it's not going to do anything. Millie's chilling, but boss man is not doing anything. But, if you just say like uh, 1 point, let's just call it 2, 2, and then two 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 let's see what happens okay that's pretty good so you see this is a cool script because now you're getting crazy wow oh so you get the idea of that you can totally have some fun with this cool for like maybe clouds something in the water um you know whatever you want really be creative, have some fun with it. Slow it down. Move speed. Make it make it make it one. Yeah, there you go. But I like to put the Z. It gets in your face. What the hell is one? So anyways, that's about it guys. Um have some fun with that script. Make the next Flappy Bird Cash Money Billionaire app. And uh, we'll see you in the next tutorial, guys. Thanks for watching. If you like, um, please drop a like and subscribe. We're on the road to 3,000 subs, which is the largest YouTube channel and YouTube partner ever. Catch you next time, guys. Happy coding.